Now let us try to understand self inductance. We saw that that it is m11, right? Which is nothing but l1 that came out to be mu naught n square pi r square into l. Correct. Now this is nothing but but what n phi is equal to is equal to l1 i right correct now differentiating both sides with respect to t differentiating both sides with respect to t we get d d t of n phi is equal to d d t into l1 i and if i multiply it by minus 1 it becomes this <coughs> so di upon dt right <coughs> we understand now this is what is e so try to understand it's a it's a beautiful concept look So let us say there is a coil like that, okay? So, so there is a coil like that, and say it is connected to some some battery, and I try to push a current. You know? So what happens? What happens? Immediately, there is a current set up inside it. Due to that, there is a field which is linked by the coil itself and since it has changed in finite time there is a there is an emf which opposes you the emf produced in the coil as a result of the current being set up in it or 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 wait 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 better write the flux linked by the coil as a result of the current being set up in it changes in finite time and results into an induced EMF an induced EMF which opposes the setting up of this current correct this induced emf is given a specific name <clears throat> this induced emf is called back emf
back EMF. Okay? That is which opposes the setting. Yeah, the setting itself. So, so if you are trying to trying to build a current, so so the current goes immediately. It is faced by a back EMF, so it does not increase that much. Okay, so so kind of it becomes steady for some time. So it, it again gets up, again is faced by a resistance, again gets up, stops, gets up. That's how it builds, right? And what happens in the beginning? In the beginning. This 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 is uh, this is very small as as you switch it on. Maybe maybe when we switch on a motor, what happens? This back EMF is is negligibly small. So suddenly you'll you'll see the starting current to be about 20 times the rated current. So there is a huge amount of of current that is called an inrush current in motors. So there is an inrush current, and as the motor picks up speed and it sets up more current into it the back emf rises to substantially high value and the running the running current of the motors that settles down to a small value so the maximum damage that can happen to a motor is while it is starting up okay everything any motor that starts takes in a huge amount of current and that's why repeatedly switching on and switching off of any electronic or electrical equipment is prone to damage it faster. Okay, so you, you, you switch on and switch off your AC say 50 times, there is every probability it will go away. Okay, fine. And that's why they do not allow the compressor to pick up. So what happens, even if you switch, in, switch on and switch off, it will take full two minutes to, to ramp up the compressor. That is why. Okay. So, so, this is called the back EMF. This back EMF keeps the current value of a running motor to a, to a small value. Okay. It is very, very, very important. Fine. <coughs> okay. Now, let us say we have three circuits. Fine. So, so I am discussing EMF in multiple circuits. Let us say we have three circuits. Okay. Let there be three circuits. Okay. Now, now what is the flux linked by these circuits? So flux linked by circuit 1, 2, 3 respectively are what? N1 phi 1 is equal to M11, you understand, it is M11 I1, flux in 1 due to current in 1 plus flux in 1 due to current in 2, M12 I2, flux in 1 due to current in 3, I3 N2 phi 2 flux in 2 due to current in 1 flux in 2 due to current in 2 
fluxin 3 due to fluxin 2 due to current in 1 fluxin 2 due to current in 2 fluxin 2 due to current in 3 and n3 phi 3 is fluxin 3 due to current in 1 plus fluxin 3 due to current in 2 <coughs> fluxin 3 due to current in 3 is it not differentiating all the three and taking negative on both sides fine so differentiating all the three equations and taking negative on both sides we get what do we get it is minus ddt of <coughs> n1 phi 1 is equal to minus ddt of m1 1 i1 plus sorry minus ddt of m1 2 i2 minus ddt of and and i am doing two things simultaneously right to save time i am taking this is a constant so i am taking it out as well right so i will write minus m11 ddt of i1 okay minus oh, there is a reason ddt i2 minus minus m13 ddt of i3 will soon become clear why we are not doing that and this is my e1 right this is my e1 this thing so minus ddt n2 phi 2 is equal to minus m21 d i1 upon dt minus m22 d i2 upon dt minus m23 d i3 by dt minus d dt of n3 phi 3 is equal to minus m31 d i1 by dt minus m32 d i2 upon dt minus m33 d i3 upon dt right now now what do i get these are nothing but but e1 okay or, or okay this is e1 this is e2 this is e3 okay now what happens do i erase this now what happens is 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 a wonderful thing is i can write it as e1 e2 e3 is equal to m11 m12 m13 m21 m22 m23 m31 m32 m33 into maybe i take out minus so so it 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 makes everything minus and i write di1 upon dt di2 upon dt di3 upon dt now you understand why m11 is not being written as l1 and that is the reason we have defined things to be like that now if you have to write a 50 by 50 matrix what do you have to do nothing m11 till m150 m21 m31 m51 50 50 by 50 finished and you can feed it to a computer the computer will take care of the rest right 
and it is these problems to solve which you are being taught matrices it's not just just out of the box that you are being taught these things they have got a tremendous amount of use when you move forward and start handling any system be it electrical mechanical okay or or chemical or or whatever and and see how simple it becomes suddenly no this is a, a, this is how we had named a11 a12 a13 that is the convention in matrices a21 a22 a23 that's why we a31 a32 a33 <laughs> and then you'll understand the reason why it was effect cause in the first place right do we get that fine so 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 that is the reason that is the whole reason why why we do not write m11 as l1 because it it yields very readily to the form of a matrix 